What's up, guys? My name's Kenny. Hope you're all feeling good today. It is Tuesday, March 26. We're going to play Wordle Connections, the mini crossword, and strands all back to back in this video. Let's try to have a good day. Let's try to be positive. Yesterday, um, uh, I was playing a lot of chess yesterday. By the way, if you guys aren't aware, I do have a another channel, which is FGK Chess, where I just play chess every single day. There's a new video, so if you guys aren't subscribed over there, go subscribe to that. There is a link in the description. But anyway... I was having one of those days where I just kept losing over and over again, and I got really, really angry. I started getting, like, like I, it was a bad day. <laughs> it was a really bad day, so I, I kind of wasn't positive yesterday. So I'm trying to come back from that. So let's try to be positive today, even if I lose. Also, I lost my Wordle streak yesterday. So we are at zero. That is also not good. <laughs> this, I just had a bad day yesterday. Um, let's go ahead and... Um, Put in uh, flank as my starting guess because uh, that's what the randomizer gave me. So let's see what flank gets me. All right, just an A. Okay, so. Uh, stare, no, the A is not in the middle, okay. Um, uh, Party. Let's do party. That doesn't really test out another vowel, though. Oh, there's a Y in this word, but it's not there. Okay, it's not in the fifth position, so... Hmm. Uh, I'm thinking something like payer, but it can't be a P. It can't be layer, either. It could be mayor with an O. Yes! Okay, that's good. That's good. <laughs> okay, there we go. Uh, I want to check out Squirtle for this one, because getting it in three like that... I mean, having the Y not be in the fifth position, uh, of course, narrowed things down quite a bit. But... I have to imagine there might have still been other possibilities. Like I said, um, layer and pair could have been available if those letters were there, but they weren't. Um, so I wonder if there's anything else like that or anything else with the A-Y-O-R. Um, so I started with blank and then I went with uh, party. Gayer, okay, that's the one, that's one I did not see. Hayer, Sayer, Sayer, okay. Bayer, Raid, Mayor was right there. That's probably, out of all these words, yeah. Mayor was certainly the best one that I thought of. I definitely was not going to think about Gayer or, like, Sayer, maybe Sayer. Yeah, there's, I mean, maybe there's a chance for either of those, but I guess if I would have looked at all the letters, I would have thought about Gayer and Sayer. I didn't know Hayer or Bayer would be a word, though. But, Jaeger. Okay, yeah, I, did, I didn't see. Yeah, I, I think I got pretty lucky there with uh, flank and party narrowing things down for me. So anyway, got in three today. That's pretty good. Leave a comment. Let me know how you guys did on this one. Uh, time to move on to connections. So give me a moment to open that up real quick. Okay. Here we go. Connections, uh, March 26th. Let's go ahead and see what we got. Okay. We have Bud Light as two of the top words. And Corona on here. Okay. So they, they have some sort of a beer thing here. Okay. We have Harp, Recorder. These are instruments. Bassoon. And Bass. I think that's just an instrument category. Yeah, there we go. Okay, now what? Is there something with rays? Like, hmm, I don't see one. Oh, I, I should probably think about what bud means. Bud is like a pal, a buddy, a friend. I don't see anything there, though. Radiation? Oh, radiation, like, maybe flare... Bloom? Is Bloom one? Light, maybe? 
Hmm. I'm thinking of like an explosion or something or like, I don't know. Sprout Bloom. Foster and Ray's kind of go together. Nurse. Is there another one that makes sense here? Rear. How is rear going to fit? Does rear... Is there another meaning for rear which is like... I know there is another meaning for rear. But does rear mean like to take care of? It might be. I'm going to try it. I'm just going to use up a guess here if it's wrong. No, that was right. Bring up. Okay. I knew there was a meaning to rear like that, but I like I I thought maybe it was slightly different than that. So I I was hesitant to put it in. Okay. Um Oh, wait a minute. No. Flare bloom corona. And light, maybe? Or something. There's something to do with, like, cameras and you see, like, light in the picture or something. Or something related to photography. I'm going to put these in. No, it's one away. So maybe instead of light, it's radiation? No, that's still one away. Okay, I don't quite understand that, but I feel like I'm close. Maybe Bloom doesn't go with that. Bloom... Oh, Bloom Bud Sprout. Aren't these... Like, flower related? Or, and then maybe shoot? Yeah, okay, plant growth. I can't believe I didn't see that earlier. I, I wasn't really thinking about... No, with Bloom, I thought about plants. But I didn't think about... And Sprout, obviously. But I didn't even... Wow, I just didn't even make that category. I didn't really put it together. But yeah, light, corona, flare, and radiation. <sighs> what would the category specifically be, though? It's something to do with, like, light and, like, lens flare or something. So let's just see what it is. I don't know exactly. Solar emanations. Okay, so I was not really right there. Oh, yeah, I see. Okay. I think I got caught up on Bloom, because I think Bloom, there's a photography thing. Let me look it up. Maybe not. Maybe I'm making that up. I thought Bloom was a thing. Bloom is an effect that you can add on, like, pictures digitally or something. Or something. I don't know. There's something there. So I was thinking of, like, flare in that sense as well. Yeah, flare is like a... F I, I was thinking just images and, like, pictures... And, like, how they can have bloom or flare. And a corona is a light thing. But, yeah, I, 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 that, that, that's probably just, like, three there. I don't think light or radiation makes any sense for, like, that. So, um, not too bad today. Uh, didn't quite get the last one. Took me a minute for plant growths. But, anyway... Uh, let me know in the comments how you guys did on connections. Uh, let's go ahead and move on now to the mini crossword. Uh, I think yesterday I did not do well on the mini, so hopefully I can do better today. Or one of these days, I think it was yesterday, I didn't do good. Okay, here we go. Mini crossword. Let's go ahead and begin. Let's see how I do. Student celebrating in the late spring. Um, student celebrating the late, late spring. What would you celebrate in the late spring? Is it, I mean, it could be prom, is that, or, I was thinking more like graduation. I don't know. 
but maybe that I don't know. Early spring bloomers. There's that word bloom. Um, <laughs> early spring. What does that mean? Flower, something like a flower or a plant. I mean, plant is seems too generic. I don't know. Birds symbolizing the start of spring. What's up with all these spring words? Is it because spring is spring technically just starting right now? I didn't even think about that. <laughs> I guess it probably is, right? Yeah, okay. Birds symbolizing the start of spring. Uh, I, I should know this, but I can't think of it. Printed piece of punditry. I don't exactly know what punditry is, so that's going to be a problem. Tie the knot to wed. Feel around in the dark. Feel around. I'm not going to get this one today. Feel around in the dark. Yeah, that's a tough one. Like many sauna users. I don't... What's the terminology around saunas? Like they're... You're hot. I don't... Low pH substance. I don't... I don't know anything about pH stuff. It's been a while since I took chemistry. Cacophonous clatter. Don't know. Raven lookalike. Crow. Okay, well, that helps me. Okay, so now with two... Let's see. Early spring bloomers. Early spring bloomers. Um... I don't get it. Birds symbolizing the start of spring. It starts with R. Uh, Robin, hopefully. Starts with R. Printed piece of hunted tree. Hmm. I, I have no idea. Feel around in the dark. Okay, maybe if I close my eyes and imagine that I'm in the dark and I'm feeling around. Um, I don't know. Uh, probe? I think that's right, actually. Uh, like many sauna users. So actually doing this actually helped me. <laughs> Uh, like many sauna users. A B there. B-E-D. Maybe. Like robed? Like they're wearing a robe? That would fit here with the letters? This might be wrong here, though, but I'm trying to look at seven across. OB, I mean, probe, probe might be wrong. Probe and robed, that is funny. Maybe they, did, maybe that's intentional, so maybe that is the answer. Oh, wait, prom. I forgot about this one. I said prom earlier, and I didn't go back to that clue. Okay, well, that makes things a little bit easier. Okay. Cacophonous. I probably said that totally wrong. Clatter, I don't know what that means. Cacophonous. Clatter. What? Low pH substance. Ah, uh, I, I gotta look at the letters on the keyboard for this one. Um, I 
I don't know. I, I really, I, I can't come up with these ones. I don't know this spring bloomer. It's probably just a flower. That's why I don't know it. Yeah, I, I think I got to give up. Let's see what the answer is. Reveal the puzzle for me. Grad. Oh, prom was wrong. Grope. Oh, probe was so good, though. Cro Crokai? Oped? Din? Okay, so having the M there did not help me. I didn't... I, what is cacophonous? Cacophonous. I think it's cacoc... Cac cacophonous. Gotta look up that word, because that is a new vocabulary word. Having an unpleasant mixture of sounds. I've probably heard it before, but... Like a cacophony. I've heard cacophony. But cacophonous? I, okay, I guess, I don't know what that means. <laughs> um... <clears throat> Students celebrating in the late spring. So I was right about graduation, but so that the individual would be a grad. And I, I thought probe was really good, but it was a grope. And then what is oped? Oh, op-ed. Gosh, I, I always do that. I always do that, where I, I don't read it as multiple things like that. Is that really seven o'clock? Punditry. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Acid. Okay, acid. Low pH substance. Yeah. Not really familiar with basic chemistry stuff, so. All right. Well, that was tough. Not doing too well on the minis lately, but that's okay. Once again, trying to just stay positive, even though I, <laughs> I'm bad at some of these sometimes. Um, let's move on to strands. We got one more game. Let's go ahead and uh, see what we got there. Yesterday's was also tough for me with that. Um, here we go. Strands. Let's see what we got. That's fantastic. That's fantastic. Zoom in here. Okay, that's fantastic. Gospel. That is not a word on here. Um, that's fantastic. So, hmm. So what could it be? What could the word be for span for the spangram? Um I don't see anything yet. I'm looking at this Y right here, and I'm like, if that goes at the end of a word. Grem. Post. Uh, a Y here? There's so many Y's here. There's a Y here, there's a Y here, there's a Y here. So I'm looking at those as like ends of words. Uh, I would like to not use hints, but the way things are going right now, I might have to. I mean, I can find a lot of, like, little words, like, pest, but, I, like, there's no point in even, like, putting them in because, I mean, I guess they would give me hints. Macy. Two C's right next to each other. Like, I'm wondering if they go in the same word or not. That's fantastic. So just like things you would say that mean that's fantastic. 
or fantastic, maybe an emphasis on fan, like a fan of something. I don't know. Can't believe I found gospel right away and that wasn't it. Um. Yeah, this is this is this game is this game is too tough for me now. I thought it was really easy at the beginning when it first came out, but now it's like I don't understand the theme and like okay, yes. The more th this game will get more difficult when it's not like the first couple of days it was like you had like vegetables, it was like tomato and maybe stuff like that. Once you get more specific, the more you get into like a, a niche thing or once you get in, into, um, you know, like, like I, like yesterday, I, I didn't know the astrology things. I think it was yesterday. Uh, yeah, I, I mean, I don't want to take too long on this game. Like this game is, is not a game that I feel like spending 10 minutes on. And I feel like I oftentimes do spend 10 minutes on it. So let's just use a hint. Ergo? I saw that. Oh no, it's ogre. <laughs> okay, I thought it was like I was looking at like ergonomics, and I was like, "Is there like er that doesn't make any sense? Why would they? Why would there be ergonomics on here?" And I saw that, but I'm like, "No, ogre, ogre." So it's like mythical creatures, myth, mythology. Mythological. Mythological. Okay. Uh, fairy. Yeah, this game is impossible without using hints for me. Like, well, yeah, I, I don't know. Like, I just, I feel like I don't like this game as much as I used to. So yeah, now we're talking about mythological creatures. And like, these are not normal words for me. Like, yes, ogre is and fairy is, but, like, there's a good chance that some of these words, like, are going to be difficult for me to, to unscramble because I might not know what they are. Like, if you don't know what a word is, it's going to be really tough to get it. So, let's see if I can find one. Um... Still four words left. Mermaid? Okay. Cyclops. Okay, that was a tough one. Come on. Okay, this is difficult to control all of a sudden. There we go. Cyclops, mermaid... Okay, those were not difficult. It's tough to find it, but those were not words that like I'm not familiar with. I I am definitely familiar with them. So two more up here. Um Centaur Centaur, how you say it? Dragon. Uh, there was no way ever that I would ever be able to find dragon if it wasn't narrowed down like that. And mermaid. Maybe I could have found Cyclops. I don't think I would have ever saw Ogre. I might have saw Myth. And that, I think in this one, the thing that would have... I might have got Myth and then realized it could have been mythology or mythological. I could have found that on my own, I think. I probably could have found Fairy. But centaur, no dragon. Like those words, those letters are just no. I no. I would not. I I don't think I could play this game without hints. Like this. This is way too tough for me. Um. Yeah. I, I I'm definitely I'm definitely unsure about strands as of right now. Uh, for me personally. Um. I'm gonna keep playing it for now, but. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> it might go away in the future, guys. 
Uh, but yeah, I mean, let me know if you enjoy watching me play it, I guess. I, I just... I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Um, anyway, that's going to wrap it up for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys all have a great rest of your day. I will see you guys all tomorrow in another video. Uh, so yeah, have a good one. See you then.